Ready for green. Wigless 600. 25 laps the distance. And away we go. Whitby trying to hang on to the race lead. TJ Green way up on the top side. Looking around almost three wide for the lead out of corner number two. Ryan Goff right there as well down in the bottom. It is Green on, on top. Whitby second. Ryan Groff coming after Eric Whitby now for that runner-up spot. Timmy Buckwalter, the winner here last Labor Day weekend, runs fourth just in front of Jim Radney. Radney locked in a fight with Kyle Weck. And now Buckwalter goes topside. Grieve in front. Buckwalter storming his way to the runner-up spot. Grieve not getting away from Buckwalter. Timmy now. Sees an opening down at the bottom. Grieve washes up the banking out of turn four. And that's all Buckwalter needed. Buckwalter leads lap number eight. Buckwalter gets out in front, pulls him through the corner. Kyle Wick will motor into the runner-up spot. He's trying to bring Ryan Groff with him. They're three wide for fourth out of turn four. That's Radney, Hanley, and TJ Green. Two to go. White flag waving this time. Final tour of the speedway. He's looking to make it two in a row here at the Clyde. Oh, Kyle Wick on his nose. Yellow is out. We're not finished yet. What a tough break for Kyle Wick. Buckwalder now leading Heath Hanley and Kyle Spence. James Morris fourth. Groff and Thomas battle for fifth. Everybody right around the bottom through one and two. Buckwalder not coming off the bottom. Timmy Buckwalder wins it over Heath Hangley and Kyle Spence.